I talked to Peter Lilback about three years ago and I asked him, I said, I think George Washington knew that we would be the key to the restoration of Israel. Now Peter is one of the, the great scholars on George Washington. He told me that summer, Glenn, that I don't think you can make that case. I said, Peter, please look for me. I think you can. He came back to me about six months later. He's now put a book out with that case. We were established for the establishment of Israel. Now the question is, are we done now or not? Our markings are all over. Take out a dollar out of your pocket. Look at the great seal of the United States. Take it out. If anybody still carries a dollar, they're not worth very much anymore, but look at the great seal. You'll notice in between the wingspan of the, e of the eagle, you will see the Star of David, made out of 13 stars. Now why is the Star of David there? Because of Heim Solomon, who gave everything for our freedom. But that's not all. If you also see, and if you look at it in color, you will notice that there is a white ring around that. And then a yellow ring. The white ring looks almost like clouds, because it is. The cloud that led the people of Israel out during the day, and the, and the yellow ring represents the fire. We, in all, in all of our institutions in all of our seals. The first seal of the United States proposed by Benjamin Franklin was the parting of the Red Sea and the pillar of the fire that was going to be our symbol. We understood the God of Israel from the very beginning and we made a covenant with him.